on my days guys i've got a new inch here <laughs> what's good guys it's rakia china aka the original brat brat aka china money i don't give a fuck if you like me because i'm nice be per welcome to the video so today i've got a few appointments and stuff scheduled for today so i will be taking you guys with me yeah, so it's like 9.45, 10-ish. My interview's not till 4. So I've got a decent amount of time. I am gonna... I'm, somebody asked me to do a skincare routine. My skin is not perfect. And I'm literally only just finding stuff that is working for my skin type. But if you guys you ask and you shall receive... So, yeah. Don't even you guys. Oh, okay, yeah. No, this is a decent setup. Okay, so um, I'm going to show you guys my... <gasps> gotcha! Gotcha, bitch! Anyways, so, yeah. I'm going to quickly show you guys what I do. In the morning in regards to this i haven't even eaten yet i'm not hungry though i need to eat something i will it's not even four o'clock yet so <coughs> what i need to do is stop stressing i don't know sometimes i'm a bit funny with when i brush my teeth because like i don't want to eat right after i brush my teeth because i don't want it to not taste the way it's supposed to taste that concludes for the brush and teeth segment. Do you guys like the new intro? So then I use this St. Ives Fresh Skin Apricot Scrub. As you can see, I'm running out. I need to get more. But this is literally my holy grail when it comes to skincare. Like once I stumbled across this bad boy, I said exfoliator regular schmegular exfoliator no baby i'm gonna need my say ives honey so yeah guys i seen a right cool i've stumbled across this new company that does wax pops oh you know when i get myself some don't chat to me but yeah I'm not gonna um stop the wax videos until I get some new because I still have wax there. But like the wax video the wax videos are gonna be on a whole nother level when I get them bad boys. Understand that. But yeah guys, so I just obviously exfoliate my face, spread it all across, wet your fingertips a little bit, and exfoliate. I don't have any tools or anything. My mum got me a um little juice thing but i've moved around so much that i don't even know like is it just me that loses bare stuff when they move like i hate i will lose clothes shoes hair dryers hair straighteners whole bunch of stuff just, just goes missing when i move when my stuff starts to go missing i just feel like the fairies took it they said I need a new dress. Mama needs a new dress. Mama needs a new bag. Mama needs a new hair dryer. Oh, there's there's scrubbing my eye. There's scrubbing my eye, but wait. If you cheat on your bitch, nigga, use the bitch. I said what the fuck I said. Niggas will be niggas. Niggas will be niggas. No matter how much money they've got, niggas will be niggas. But see, this I don't want to rap a boyfriend. If you're a rapper, stay away from me. Just get away. Just get away, please. If you're a rapper or you're trying to be a rapper, it's the ones trying to be. <laughs> oh, it's the ones that we that are trying to be rappers that we need to stay away from, as well as the rappers. But yeah, so as you guys can probably tell, I've exfoliated my face with the same Ives wash. I've just let my face air dry. Now we're back in my bedroom, and I'm gonna show y'all the potions and lotions I've got in here. For my face this has been if you guys cannot see like okay yeah i've got a little blemish here but in terms of 
the other like what else was on my face this is really clearing up my face like i don't know how to feel so i just ooh, put this on my face and i massage it in i used to have one of those jade roller things but it's broken now so you know i literally just massage this into my face but then I take my Blistex. If you guys know about Blistex, then you know. Uh, if you don't know, get with the program. So this is uh, Bourjois Paris Healthy Mix Sorbet Blush Apricot Tinted Drop. And I use it on my lips. Sometimes I do do it underneath my eyes. Just because like, so it's very orange. Um, The tint is very orange. Like it is red, but it's orange. And um. I do use colour corrector when I do my makeup. So when I put it underneath my eyes, I feel like it just brightens underneath my eyes. Um, I don't do that all the time. I only really do that when I know that I'm going to be doing makeup. And I actually am going to do some makeup today, so I probably should. But yeah, guys, that's what I literally do on my face. Okay, cool. I need you guys to help me decide what I'm going to wear today. Shit. Okay, let me get everything and then I will come back and holler at you guys. Okay, so I'm back. I've literally got a few outfit options. Right, cool. Oh, guys, I cannot wait for my hauls. I'm going to do my hair as well in a minute. Um, I cannot wait for the clothing hauls that are coming, guys. Stay tuned, stay tuned. But, yeah, so I got this dress. It's a black dress. I feel like this is very likely going to be what I wear today. I can't even lie. But I'm just trying to think about... Okay, let me show you guys my other options because, but this is number one at the minute. I've got this skirt and then I've got the options between this, this uh, bodysuit, it's a bodysuit. Then I've got this shirt, obviously I need to iron it, but pretty details, details, details. On my days, I just figured out another way to spell Kate cute guys i've i've been being really weird recently so instead of putting qt i put qt and now i've said cute that's another way for me to spell cute i just like to find dumb ways to spell things like if you don't know i spell chai money c h y m u n i that's not how you spell money obviously but I like to play on words personally so but anywho and then obviously i got my underwear guys this is a self-confidence trick for me you guys don't have to listen to me but for all my females i don't really men it depends on what you like to wear but my tip for confidence boosting for you guys is get yourself some nice underwear get yourself some nice underwear underwear that makes you feel comfortable in yourself underwear that makes you feel like a bad bitch underwear that you pull it off and you look at yourself in the mirror and you're like eh, what's goody maybe i should wear something new that i haven't worn before that doesn't have any bad memories attached to it not saying that all of those clothes have bad memories attached to them because they don't but it's a new it's a new thing so maybe i should just start afresh and wear this dress oh i got this time ago there don't go walking around like you don't know what goes around gotta come right back her but yeah i got this time ago as you guys know because i did a little haul guys my hauls don't be big but they be banging um should i just wear this guys i feel like i'm just gonna wear this can't lie and then i've got my i'm gonna probably wear it with my uggs i clean them i got some makeup powder on them but wow anywho yeah i think that's what i'm gonna do actually so let me just put everything else away i'm gonna do my hair next time you guys see me i'm probably gonna like be eating or i would have just got out of the bar or something but i'm gonna be back all right guys so i'm out the shower and i'm not gonna show you guys because i'm not dressed yet but um i've done my hair i basically so the wig that i used to do my ponytail i had a straight one of it i'm about to iron my dress because it's a bit too creased and then i'm gonna do my edges as you can see um but yeah i feel like guys i've got a story time for you guys yeah 
and I feel like I want to tell this story but I don't at the same time that like, people really be drawing me out for no reason I don't bother nobody I stay my bed my bed's a mess okay it's okay though because i'm gonna clean it before i go i still got a few hours um but i literally just had a little brainwave so i wanted to share it with you guys let me know if you guys would be interested in me doing some story times because i do have a few story times under my belt or whatever but yeah um but then again a part of me just wants to leave it all behind me like literally like i actually just want it's above me it's fucking above me <laughs> guys as you can see i'm ready hold on a second um well i'm actually about to go now because i've been taking pictures look at the hair falling out of my box oh my gosh ghetto but yeah no i've been taking pictures and snapchats and stuff my battery's running low i'm such a brave character i'll be leaving the house sorry this bit is really shambles but i'll be leaving the house with my phone 20 percent, 35 percent. like very very brave but let me give you a little fit check real quick let me where you guys can see me because i'm not doing a lot of things but can you guys even see hold on let me take you guys in here quickly maybe you'll see better um let me just quickly fit check y'all fit check which i was saying i'm finna wear my uggs as well um but yeah, I'm literally about to go now. Oh, I left my headphones upstairs. I'm going to go now. And I'm going to go to the GP first though because... And I forgot my form. So, you know, lovely. Love that for me. Um, But yeah, I'm literally going now. I will holler at you guys when I'm a bit more together. <laughs> Hi guys. So, oh, look at my car. <gasps> That's the GLC 43 day. Oh, it's still laying there. Guys, I'm obsessed with Mercedes at the minute. Um, but yeah, so I just went to the GP and gave in my form. Going to my interview now. Um, people keep looking at me. And I'm going to assume it's because I'm beautiful. <laughs> I'm joking but yeah people keep looking at me and I don't know how to feel like even before I pull up, pulled out the camera people was looking at me so I low-key hate being out like that's what the biggest joke is like I know I feel I look like I'm in my element well I low-key am because hot girl summer is approaching you know hot girl summer is approaching I'm about to be out here shaking my motherfucking ass not out here specifically but you know what I mean I feel like such a fashion icon right now because I look cute. Like, can I just tell y'all that I look, did I tell y'all I look good today? Wait, my skirt, my dress is riding up a little bit though. Let me put it down. There's boys in the park and they're looking at me. <laughs> Let me just, okay, anyway. Icon. And I met a really nice lady in the GP. She told me my eyelashes was cute. And she was like, she was telling me my eyelashes was really nice. She was like, where did you get them from? I was at Amazon. She was like, oh, swear down. She was like, my friend was telling me about a good steal on Amazon as well. They were magnetic ones. I was like, yeah, my friend's got them as well. She, she was telling me that they're the talk of the town. Or whatever the case may be. But yeah, I'm all holler at you guys in like, the next clip hi guys so i just left my appointment i hope you guys can hear me because i'm outside but i just left my appointment i'm about to go home now but i think it went well i'm hoping and praying that it went well i think it did uh so yeah my phone's on two percent though so i'm not gonna um i'm not gonna be on here for long but i gotta get the right light oh my gosh the block's hot the block's hot i'm joking but um yeah, I'm gonna holler at you guys when I get home and I charge my phone. Hey guys, so I'm home now. As you can see, I had a little outfit change. I haven't taken off my makeup yet, but I'm about to do that and wrap my hair up in that. Um, got a little itchy. -er. 
but i just wanted to check in but yeah i'm happy i went out i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and into oh that's one thing so guys on my way to my destinations today um i had to go past the car showroom and it was a beautiful like, when i tell you it's a very like it's nice like they do ferraris and aston martins like nice cars in it so i was looking at the cars and i was just so intrigued that i had to go in there like around the doorbell i went and i went to the door and pushed it and it wasn't open but i seen the guys in the offices so i rang the doorbell and they let me in and i come to the back now and i'm like um obviously i just wanted to know if it was possible to get a tour and get like the history of the cars and stuff and he was like yeah no that's fine but obviously because of covid we're not supposed to have anybody in the shops at the moment but um when covid starts you know whatever so guys in the summertime i will 150 percent be going and getting a car tour i don't know if i'm gonna do it by myself or if i'm gonna do it with friends but that is definitely something for you guys to look forward to but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog so yeah um make sure you like comment and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend it's my birthday next month guys very exciting we're gonna we gonna shut down we gonna take over youtube or something i don't know i don't know what we finna do but we finna do something you know, because we can't be having tourist season and it not being a bang. So, yeah, um, I'm about to finish editing because I started editing already. So, I'm about to finish editing this one. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay healthy, stay pretty, girl. You better lift up them titties. And I will see you guys in the next video. <laughs> All I remember